An Indianapolis man faces charges, including dealing narcotics and marijuana. Police tell us their drones led them right to the suspect. Tonight, our Rachel Krause explains this latest arrest and how the drone program helps police work safer and more efficiently. Five charges have been filed against Aaron Dumas. Police say Dumas led police on a high-speed chase last Friday night before eventually crashing his car and taking off on foot. Court documents say officers found the wrecked car along with a jar of marijuana, oxycodone pills, and cash inside. To locate Dumas, an officer with IMPD sent up a drone. The probable cause affidavit says within minutes, the drone was able to locate Dumas in a creek bed. Police then bringing him into custody. This is just the latest arrest to be made with the help of a drone. IMPD's drone program has been in place since 2018 and quickly become a vital tool for police. We're making apprehensions, not every day, but multiple during the, during the week. Um, we're deploying drones multiple times a day, um, whether it's for the operational side, the district side, or it's for SWAT. Sergeant Ron Shelnut, IMPD's aviation unit commander, says the department has 12 drones and 13 drone pilots. They're able to utilize drone technology for locating suspects using cameras on board, even thermal technology to help locate heat changes on the ground, allowing police to work smarter and faster while making apprehensions safer. We can't see thermal with our eyeballs heat. Um, these drones can see that. So what it allows me to do when we're providing providing overwatch for canine, um, we can see that heat source and we can warn that canine team on the ground. Dumas is facing charges of dealing narcotics and marijuana as well as reckless driving and resisting law enforcement. He'll be back in court next week. In Indianapolis, Rachel Krause, 13 News.